<laughs> we did a very lazy Sunday thing. We're out. Yeah, normally hate McDonald's, but this morning we wanted something fried and disgusting. It's weird because we haven't got hangovers or anything, but we just fancy something gross. So we're here having delicious, gross things. Mmm, mmm. <laughs> Check out what we are making today. Mm -hmm. Two delicious beef pizzas. This can't be so good. Yeah, most of the day we've just been chilling with baby. It's not supposed to be a vlog day anyway, so go away. Honey, did you like your pizza? Good morning, everybody. Well, it's not such a good morning. I woke up to a letter from uh, HMRC saying I've got a hundred pound fine to pay. Yeah. Shush, Toby, <laughs> you silly fuck. But you can't be too upset when this guy's doing this. What are you doing? What are you doing? Do you think dogs sometimes just do stuff? Do you think dogs sometimes just do stuff just to cheer you up? Things aren't that bad when you've got a stupid dog, have they? <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> things can't be. <laughs> <laughs> Things can't be that bad, can they? When you've got when you've got a stupid dog to cheer you up like that in the morning. So I'm gonna really knuckle down and get that that all sorted out and get that business shut down and closed off because it's something that I've been dreading, like all the other things getting uh, getting my debts in order. I was dreading that getting my benefits sorted. I was dreading that getting another job. I was dreading that. But I've done all of those and I've kind of conquered them and I've gone, I've become stronger because I can cope with them and I've sorted them out and my life is better for it and I'll be happier and I'll be well and my mental state will be a lot more positive in the end. As you can tell it's evening now and um, after that rather nasty wake up to finding this uh, fine letter I've sort of taken positive steps that I can do at the moment to resolve it. So I tried messaging and speaking to the other guy that was in the partnership with me and he actually responded which is very different because he hasn't done that in months when he just walked out of the business one day. So that's one thing that's happened that's good and then I spent my day away in fantasy land which has been kind of just to, to stop the panic and dread which normally leads to really bad reactions from me in terms of I run to things like alcohol and cigarettes and bad things that are not conducive to positivity in general and um, so I just lost myself in this which is Fables and it's called Happily Ever After and this Neil Gaiman collection called Midnight Days and I've read them from cover to cover enjoyed the beautiful artwork and got lost in some stories Good morning everybody Yes I've woken up as a 
better morning than yesterday morning, I guess, because I haven't had a horrible letter. Still feeling quite lacklustre. And so to fight it, getting on and doing stuff. Washing and dog walks. I'm trying to make the day feel positive despite feeling groggy myself. So so it's my turn today with the carrier. So little baby Alora, he's back here somewhere. There she is. So yeah, oh it's really comfortable to wear and it feels really good to have her back on my back again. Because I missed carrying her about like a little monkey. It was really good. And uh, yeah, it's ever so comfortable to wear. I've never worn one of these before. Well, we got caught in the rain, uh, but we put the jacket Bean was wearing over the baby's head. <laughs> Bean stole my hat. I wore the hood of that jacket, and baby stayed dry. Um, but we and got, got so <laughs> yeah, Bean got brain freeze because she was so cold. Her arms actually went purple. We were right now. Um, but yeah, it was really, really funny. Um, so we thought we'd better dry off, um, dry off in. The lovely little cafe that we like to go and um, called the Gallery Coffee Bar. We've been here loads of times, and they've got some great little toys for Ali to play with. So uh, she's currently doing some adding for us. She's doing the. Ali could do the accounts for me. Yeah, Ali's going to do the accounts. Ali, going to do the accounts. Don't think she's going to do the accounts. So the weather's turned nice again, so we're going to try and get around this lake before the bad weather comes back in. And this is like the nature reserve bit, and it's like an RSPB um, spot of natural beauty, and uh, kind of opposite the land, which is the park and ride bit, we can get trains at night. singing right at my face. <laughs> Very cute. Beanie, oh. where you got? Cheers. We just got the cutest thing from Warren's Bakery. <coughs> it's a mini <coughs> pasty. Right, Ali, do you want pasty? <coughs> there you go. Oh, oh, wow. The dogs are in trouble. This guy here. He. Stole my shoe and stole my mum's laptop charger. Don't say you didn't do it because I know you did it. You did do it. You did. Got your pathetic teeth marks in it. <laughs> 